Okay, new to the horror stash, I got this complete set one and two of true crime trading cards. Uh, these are vintage cards. I think they uh, go back to about uh, early 90s, 90 to 93, something like that. Um, this is the complete uh, set, first set and second set. First set is composed of, uh, you know, gangsters, I think it's called. Let's see, I have it here somewhere. Uh, true Crime, G-Men, and Gangsters. And then the second set is called, actually, um, Serial Killers and Mass Murderers. So what's cool about these is, you know, it's it's got little art pictures on each card, but on the back of the card, like for instance, Al Capone here, it'll say a complete bio of him, himself, where he's from, you know, type of, uh, you know, activities. Uh, like I said, if we get back here towards the, uh, the uh, these are all the G-men and gangsters. But if we get back here towards the serial killers and murderers, you, know, you got some of the big names, Albert Fish, Richard Ramirez, John Wayne Gacy, Charles Manson, David Berkowitz, Jeffrey Dahmer, Ed Gein. Zodiac Killer. I'm just picking out the names that you would more than likely know. Green River Killer. Jack the Ripper. But it's pretty cool. You, you know, you can read the back of some of these and, and, and they're, the bios are incredible. Um, like I said, you can get these on eBay. That's where I got these. Um, I've seen one card go up to five to ten dollars. I've seen cards, a complete set, go up to about two hundred and fifty dollars. Um, I got a really good deal on this set, um, so I had to had to pick them up. But there you go. If uh, you want me to talk more about each one separately in another video, I certainly can do that. But right now, I guess I'm just gonna put them aside in the collection and uh, yeah. Just hang on to them.